I didn't come here to tell you how this is going to end. I came here to tell you how it's going to begin. I'm going to hang up this phone, and then I'm going to show these people what you don't want them to see. I'm going to show them a world without you. A world without rules and controls, without borders or boundaries. A world where anything is possible. Hey guys, James here from Hackathon, and today I'm going to go ahead and show you another, a few more jailbreak techniques which you can go ahead and use to uh, escalate the privilege in uh, Linux. As you can see right now, I am in the uh, uh, James uh, profile that's a uh, low privilege profile, but it has got some misconfigured pseudo files, so I would be. Uh, of using those particular uh, permissions that I've been given, uh, sudo hyphen l, and you can see these permissions that you that I've got here, and I'm gonna go ahead and use those permissions uh, to uh, get a uh, root prompt. So the let's start with the easier ones first, then I'll go ahead and show you a few codes that you can go and use to uh, perform this task. So sudo hyphen bin and that should give you a prompt. Uh, there you go. So I'll just do an exit out of here. Cool. sudo python hyphen c import os os dot system. Uh, what was it? Slash bin slash Dash, yeah, that's pretty much it. And yeah, there we go. We've got root prompt. And if I do uh, ID, yeah, there we go. We are in root. So I'll just do an exit out this and I'll come back root prompt. Now let's see if we can use Perl or not. So I'll just use a one liner for Perl sudo Perl hyphen E. Slash bin slash bash. Yeah, let's see if this thing works or not. Mm, just go ahead and make sure of something. There you go, we've got root prompt. So if I do an ID here, yeah, and root. Uh, I'll show you a method where an insider is required as well. <laughs> so I should say, uh, but uh, let's go ahead and do something first. Let's go ahead and uh, code a program first. So uh, let's do a sudo nano, let's say jb.c. Alright, so hash include stdio.h hash include eni std.h void main X E C L. Now this takes, uh, if I remember, uh, three uh, arguments slash bin slash let's say sh sh zero. Yeah, that's yeah, that looks. Pretty much okay, I think. Um, yeah, that's good. that looks good. So I'll just save this and I'll do a sudo gcc jb dot c and now jailbreak. Let's say. 
Let's see if this throws any errors or not. Oh yeah, my bad. Yep, my bad. Sorry. Right, so that has compiled successfully. So if I do a sudo dot slash shield break and I've got view prompt. If I want to be more fancy here, I can go ahead and probably uh, do a bash here. And I can compile this and run this, and we get a dollar, like double prompt, like uh, sh prompt. Um, exit out this. So if I go ahead and modify this a bit more, dash and uh, oops. And if I run this, there you go, I've got a new prompt, and I do an ID here, there you go, I'm root, so I'll just exit out this. Now the inside the job, well the inside the job that requires someone to be present, uh, a confidant, so as to say, who can go ahead and on the same system, of course, because there would be conflicts if you do this on a different system, like the SUI, like the uh, GUIDs would not match for the users, so you'll have to do that on the same system. So, this particular method that I'm going to go ahead and show you, uh, someone has to go ahead and uh, perform that. So, someone in, uh, with a root uh, privilege, like uh, at least a root privilege or a high privilege. So let me just enumerate that. So I'll just go ahead and exit out of this and I am in where am I? Alright, I'll go to CD slash change. I'm sorry, slash home slash change. Right, I'll go to this folder and I'll do an echo oops, echo. So uh, if I remember correctly, that was os.system. This is a uh, nmap exploit actually, but it would be going ahead and taking a few uh, Python uh, scripts as a NSE script. Like I would be piping this into an NSE script. So uh, let's say. Uh, OS dot system and we would be putting slash bin slash bash and I'll be piping this in let's see jailbird dot nse oh, okay my mistake again yeah Right. Now I'll have to do a change own uh, change shieldbird dot nse. Right. So that'll go and change the ownership to change, and I'll do a se change here. And I'm in change right now. Uh, let me see where I am. I should be in the home folder, hopefully. Yeah, I am in the home folder. Uh, looking through an ls here. Yeah, I'm in the home folder, and the jailbird is here. Jailbird.nc. So what you have to do is like sudo nmap hyphen hyphen script equals jailbird. Sorry. Dot NSC and hit enter that will start nmap and all right uh, yeah sorry my bad I'll just have to do a exit and I'll have to modify that script a bit and 
let's actually execute my system. So I'll do uh, change only once again and I'll do SU change and that will take me to change and I'll just go ahead and do a clear here real fast then sudo and map I can have a script equals jailbird dot nse let's see what happens and we have got a root prompt so if i do an id here yeah for some reason uh, the uh, keyboard is working but uh, now it's not going ahead and uh, reflecting that on the console so if i do an id here I should be going ahead and uh, okay, my caps lock is turned off. Yeah, if I do an ID, I should be getting root here. And I'll just go ahead and exit out of this and I'll quit the end map. As you can see, it quit the end map and I'm back to uh, the dollar prompt. Well, this was pretty much it. Uh, these were like the five techniques that you can go and use. There are a few more techniques, uh, but you can go ahead and pretty much figure out uh, the ways to go ahead and uh, use these kind of techniques if you've got the sudo's permission if you have gone through these uh, you know uh, examples once in your uh, labs i'm pretty sure that you would be go able to go ahead and uh, do this in real life as well like if you have the permissions well i hope that this was helpful uh, this was james once again from hackathon do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification icon to have a good day now. Bye-bye. God bless.